chose transportation as a top priority. So economic development throughout the country is very important and I think that's what the mayor here in Mobile is really trying to go toward in terms of the uh, convention center. We have a couple of callers holding. Let's see if we can take these callers. You on impact. Yeah, I wanted to follow up with the uh, last caller as far as the um, okay. goes. Uh, first of all, I'd like to make a comment as, as the, which relates to this economic, as you were just saying about the mayor conference. Um, many times when a, when a business, particularly a large business, chooses to relocate to a town, one of the first things it looks at is the school system. And I, and I, I just saw a report in the paper last, last week or maybe it was earlier this week that Mobile was the uh, was last in the state and the uh, unemployment rate was like 9 something percent. Right. The worst of the major cities in Alabama. And uh, I, I think part of that reason may be very well because of our, our uh, poor education system. Uh, many businesses will shy away from Mobile just for that reason because there's obviously plenty of land here, there's a port here, there's a lot of things that should draw a large corporation to Mobile. But I think that the uh, just the overall atmosphere with government and the school system uh, that, that it turns them off. Okay. Good and point. One thing I think that they that, that they may look into that I think that they should do is, is like you said, there seems to be a lot of um, misunderstanding among the people of Mobile as far as, as what this money is going to go for. I, I've heard people at work say that well, if we if we give them an increase, it's just going to go in the pockets of the uh, of the people in charge. It's not going to get down to the kids. Or it's all going to get tied up into uh, legal fees. Uh, I think that there's a lot of misunderstanding out there where this money's going to go, and I think that they really need to, to hire some somebody to uh, to promote this levy. Okay. Uh, right now they're just kind of relying on the media. They're not really going out and aggressively promoting this levy and educating the public as to the, the necessity of it and where the money's going to go. Okay. Those are some good points. We have a, a couple of other calls uh, on the line. Thank you for your call. You're on impact. You're on impact. Lost two callers. You're on impact. Hey, how you doing tonight? Okay. Uh, right I'm against any, any new taxes for the, uh, for that, the system, whatever you call it, school system. Right. Uh, I mean, I mean, look at it this way. They got brand new prisons. Is that making the prisoners any better? No. Uh, Brother, we got homosexuals teaching our children. We know what they're teaching. They're teaching that they come from apes and monkeys. Okay, hold, hold, hold it for a minute. So you say that you are against the tax increase. We're taking all our children out and putting them in, in home schools. We're teaching our children. We don't appreciate what the system is doing. They're okay, teaching so children that they're from monkeys and apes. Do you believe that? They don't have any spiritual value. Did you see the movie uh, the other night? Which one? Uh, on Channel 10. About what? And I can mention Channel 10 on cable. Okay. <laughs> uh, it was um, Inherit the Wind. Oh, uh, yeah, and I thought that was very slanted. It was anti-Christ, anti-Christian. Okay. I enjoyed some things, but they made Christians out to look like a bunch of nuts. Okay. We're not nuts, brother. I'm an Indian. Even Indians have a few spiritual values. Okay. We've we got good children's spiritual values. Why can't we? Okay, we have a couple other calls. Okay, thank you for thanks. your comments. You're on impact. Yes, I want to make a comment on that school deal. Why don't the print the salary the people make to down at Martin Academy and let the people see what they're paying their tax money for. Okay, that's a good point. They all complain about an international paper company making too much money. The people at the paper mill, they out of work on account of it. Let the taxpayers see what they're paying their money for. Okay, we're running out of time. Let's go to the other line. Thank you. You're on impact. A couple of quick comments. Okay. School board does not appear.